are Nikki and Carlo and our family live in Positano, Italy, nearly 500 steps from the road but surrounded by fruit and olive trees and with a fabulous view. Our garden overlooks the sea and we grow our own food. We show you what life is really like on the Amalfi Coast. So please subscribe and welcome to the Positano Diaries. Got a month's worth of fallen leaves to clean up in the garden. Hello, not my cat. Vuoi spiegare perché stavo ridendo prima? Perché <laughs> tu mi fai ridere. Che c'ho? <laughs> c'ho qualcosa di strano. Sì, ma c'è un bel capello. <laughs> è troppo bello. Ok, guarda, quando vedrò il video capirò che stai parlando. Questo è il cappello è strano, non capisco. È bello, no, mi piace. Ok. Calm. Or maybe calm at 8.30 in the morning. But when you turn around, you realize something is not quite right. Why is the toaster outside? Why is the coffee machine outside? Why is the cat escaping? Are we moving? This is the current situation. We are having the house painted. We have got our friend Jerry around, who is a professional painter. He's going to do a much better job of it than we would. And he's going to give a whitewash to the whole house, which is desperately needed. Now, I've taken down a whole load of pictures from here, and I forgot to take a photo of the order they were in before. So that's going to be a bit of a nightmare, but I think I can probably find it in some old video. Well, Skye is not going to recognise the place when she wakes up and comes up for breakfast. Is she going to get any breakfast? That is the other question. Luckily, I thought about that and I have saved a packet of Cheerios and a bowl and a spoon. And the fridge is still, oh, the fridge is wrapped up now. My Swedish Christmas star, which has been hanging at the top of the arch inside the window for the last eight years, might have to be thrown away. It is absolutely disgusting. <laughs> Obviously, it's not something that I thought about ever cleaning and it's made of cardboard. So I think that's gonna have to go. What a shame, I love that star. Hello everywhere, siamo in una nuova situazione di sistemazione. Quindi prima che arriva la nuova cucina, noi abbiamo pensato di pitturare un po' la casa, che insomma erano anni che non veniva pitturata, quindi... And this is what we have been reduced to. This is our kitchen. Last night, dinner with sandwiches, believe it or not. <laughs> the whole house is completely upside down. And here is the lovely Jerry. Hi everybody, good morning. <laughs> and uh, we're not sure where we're going to sleep tonight. <laughs> yes, it's all really a mess, but... Io faccio solo questo. Tu fai solo questo. La pittura. Just pretending. E poi il maestro pittura. Um, but the good thing about this is it gives me time to um, really have a big old clear out, which is what we've been doing in the last couple of days. I did have a bit of a panic thinking, what on earth am I going to film this week? Because this is the re reality of our week. Yeah, we'll just sort of like show you what's going on as it's going on. And I might do some shuffling around of some of the furniture. The poor animals don't know what to do with themselves at the moment. Kitty, who's actually blind, is really lost, but as long as I keep him near me, he seems to be fine. And um, hopefully in a few days we'll be back to some normality. Oh, little kitty. It's all a bit confusing, isn't it? Come here. Come here, baby. I know. I know. It's scary, isn't it? Shall we go in the other room? Innie. Come on, come in here. This is the room for you to be in. Your chair's still here, and this is where Lily is. This is the only part of the house that hasn't been touched because I painted it myself and it doesn't need to be redone. Lily. Good boy. Come on. It's okay.
having a little break from cleaning and trying to move stuff and I'm just going to go and visit the puppets for a while. you have is is one of them coming home with us well let's just say my birthday is coming up and I've always wanted a puppy for my birthday you know hello everybody Ollie oh dear what are you doing what are you doing ow oh I'm just like this dog <laughs> We're starting to put things back in order, at least in the living room. Not up there, and not through there. Kitchen is semi-working. It's been a long couple of days. <laughs> Day three of absolute chaos. We have literally moved every single item in the house. It is chaos. I can't find anything. I can't find my hair straighteners to do my hair. I can't find my makeup. I can't find anything. But it'll all be worth it in the end. Um, so we're still at it. There's still a lot of painting going on. It is the most beautiful sunny day today. Um, <laughs> it's just such a mess everywhere. Oh dear. We're in the very fortunate position to have an extra kitchen in our little guest house here um, uh, so I'm really grateful because it means I can still cook and actually we slept in here last night as well um, I don't seem to be very fortunate with the uh, whatever this is because it doesn't seem to do what I <laughs> is it me that's stupid So it's just me and Carlo, so if I can open this jar of tomatoes, I'm going to just make a very simple sauce. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> we're, we're having toast. <laughs> I'll go find Carlo, see if we can open it for me. Voy a pedirle cuesta. Ma scusa, ma tu l'hai messo? Non riesco! <ride> ma devi cacciare l'aria, se non l'abbiamo... Lo so, ma non sono riuscito. Vieni qua, vedi se si sente. Sentito? Sì. Adesso si apre con due dita. Grazie. Se no, non lo apri mai. Oh, this is the problem. The olive oil is back in the other kitchen, so I need to go over and get some olive oil, because I can't cook without that. Oh, I've got garlicky fingers. I want my house back. And next week, <laughs> we start again, because <laughs> the kitchen is going to be delivered. Oh, that's going to be a real nightmare. We're going to have to pull out our kitchen before the other one gets delivered, because they're going to deliver and put it together. So we're going to be cooking here for the foreseeable future. Olive oil. Let's play the game of find the olive oil. Wooden spoon that I got for Christmas. Thanks, Dad. 
This is some fresh ravioli that I picked up this morning. No, I didn't take you with me. Some things I do by myself. <laughs> ravioli this size usually is about 10 to 12 per person for a portion. And to cook them, you just need to plunge them into boiling water and wait until they float. And normally that takes about four or five minutes. It's really simple. This is when they're all floating, they're ready. Just drain them and put them in with the sauce and gobble them up because they're really good. I will have to try and ask at the pasta shop in Piano di Sorrento if maybe I can come in and film there one day because it is a lovely place and the ladies there make it all themselves every morning. Now I've run out of salt, I'm going to have to go and get some salt from there. Hang on, I thought we were paying you to work. <laughs> We changed today. <laughs> Ollie knows that she can come up on this step behind where I'm sitting and the puppies can't reach her. Um, and every now and again she goes, but then she comes back down again and she's actually really enjoying playing with them. And as the sun sets on the third day of complete chaos, we have the end in sight. The painting is nearly finished. There's some cleaning up going on. And I'm starting to put things back on shelves in the kitchen. And all the dust sheets have come down. Woohoo!
nothing's working, but there's something inside of you that says, I just have to follow that. Because you don't know. Call me out, but don't you learn. Lift me up higher above the clouds, won't you learn? When the scenery is right, go right in. I'm not that old yet I'm Friday young to not stand my ground but my ways are mine and I don't want to change not even for love now take back Allora oggi abbiamo lo chef Luca che ci cucinerà. <ride> chef Luca che ci cucini? Senza vongole. Senza vongole. No, ah, con le vongole. Ah, con le vongole. Allora. Questa è la normale. Vongole e lupini. Eh, ma dobbiamo sperare. E in inglese? <ride> ecco mentre io pitturo faccio le cose loro cucinano subito andremo a provare la ieri sky Spaghetti, uovo, salame, prosciutto e formaggio. Wow! Oh wow! Padre e figlio, eccolo qua! Ragazzi, noi siamo pronti! Ah, anche io! Chi c'è rimasto? Qua c'è rimasto nessuno! Tutti fuori a aspettare il cibo! And that is the end of this week's video. Thank you very much for watching. I hope it wasn't too boring, but this is basically the reality of what our week has been like. So they are starting to take off the tape, which means the painting has finally finished. And next week we get stuck into ripping out the kitchen. Hopefully we'll see you then. Bye. <laughs> Oh. <laughs>